Hey there guys, it's Keto from Brick LSI here. I'm really sorry about the time limit um, that the phone had when I was recording my Osgiliath video. And um, I decided to do a separate video that I can get into more detail with these Karuit China Lego Lord of the Rings Gondorian minifigures. Kuruit has really made a good job in making these minifigures. So much details. I did a little um, changes with the faces and some parts too. I did some switchings. Um, but anyways, let's go on to the first minifigures okay so here are the first two minifigures they are the gondorian swordsmen and um yeah Kuruit really made details on these minifigures so much details um and um you can see that Kuruit did a lot of painting everywhere <coughs> Because you really don't get um, some sort of like painting on the back part of the legs. Sorry, let me just get close up in that thing. Oh boy. Oh, there, that's better. So you can see the details for the chain mail there. And really, Lego doesn't make paintings on the side and back side and back of their minifigure legs and they got the white tree of gondor on their torsos which is really great so this is what they look like actually without their accessories and this is what they look like with their accessories on they have the cape with the white tree on it they have the very detailed gondorian helmet with the wings, the wing patterns, really cool. They have the Gondorian shields, very nice. With the white tree on them, and with those sort of like stars, the seven stars, or seven gems um, on top of the tree. And their swords, they really are very accurate to the move, to how Peter Jackson portrayed it, although Maybe Tolkien might have described their swords, but Tolkien doesn't describe their swords. So, so Peter Jackson did, or was it Weta Workshop? <laughs> I don't clearly know. Let's zoom in on this thing. Wait, guys. What happened to this? Yeah, so the sword hilt here. Let me cl close up on that. Sorry guys, for some reason this camera will not zoom up on this thing. Almost there. Oh well. Well, if you can see it from afar, you will see that the sword hilt has the pattern of Minas Tirith on it. The several layers of Minas Tirith. So yeah, those were the Gondorian swordsmen. Um, actually, this guy here was supposed to be a spearman, but I gave the spear to one of my other Karot Gondorians, which I'll get to in a bit. So, now let's go to the archer number one. So this is the Gondorian archer number one. His, um, his... Torso looks very much very similar to the to the swordsman, except he has a strap to make for like detailing that he has a quiver on his back. So this is what the guy looks like without his accessories. And here's the archer with his accessories. He's got a sort of like 
um, differently detailed bow because Lego bows, r official Lego bows have the arrow already in their bow, but Karuit doesn't. It just has the bow and a quiver with the same pattern of Minas Tirith. Yeah, it's just a very simple minifigure. Now let's go to Archer number two. Um, sorry. So this is Archer number two without his accessories. His, um, his torso and legs have a different print than the other guys. He's got some brown, oh, sort of like silver, um, silver printing, and then with different chain, slightly different chainmail. Um, he got a belt and the paint and the details for this torso it has the white tree and i think this is a zipper <laughs> i'm just guessing it's, the, it's a zipper but probably it is probably it isn't so that was archer number two without his accessories actually, actually um i switched his face his real face with um loki's face because <laughs> the original face has all smiling faces and sometimes Gondorians can be pretty grim so I added Loki's face and um, uh, and here is Gondorian number two and he's Gondorian number two because he has armor um, uh, as you can see his armor has sort of like this whole thing that you can touch the quiver piece And again, the quiver has the pattern of Minas Tirith. And this armor has the sort of like pattern of the white tree. Okay, so that was the the archer number two. Now let's go to the spearman. And so this is the spearman without his accessories. His torso and legs are identical to the archer. And his face, I switched his original face with... A Tony Stark face, which is like like when he's when he's just chilling out, <laughs> um, chilling out uh, in his Gilead, and it's like, oh no, orcs are here! I was like, ah, trying trying to get my armor. And speaking of armor, here he is, all geared up, and <laughs> this is actually the coolest Kuruit Gondorian of the lot. He has the spear with sort of like the pattern of Minas Tirith on the spear. It's a sort of like twisted end. A, sh a shield. And his armor is almost identical to the archer's um, armor. Except that he's got these sort of like leaves. Sort of like extra, extra armor. And sort of like covering for the legs. Actually, these five Kurut Gondorians are not the only Kurut Gondorians there are. There are actually, um, um, let me say, I think three more Gondorians that you can get. And I actually told you earlier that this swordsman, who has the young face without the beard, he used to be the spearman. He was the one who used to be the spearman. And this, the spearman, used to be an armored swordsman. But I really didn't think it fair that I only had um, one, one non-armored um, so, um, Gondorian swordsman. So I decided to give the spear to the... To the heavily armored guy <laughs> actually i think there is also a kuruit gondorian that looks exactly like this or maybe not but it has the same armor piece the shield and a spear and of course the helmet so yeah i think that's the end of the video just to wrap up i'll give you a look at everything so here they all are the kuruit gondorian soldiers all with helmets and oh by the way i forgot to tell you that the gondorian archer number one without the armor um actually used to have a cape but for some reason it ripped 
and now he doesn't have a cape. The only guys with capes are the uh, swordsmen. Alright guys, so that was it all to, for today um, on Brick LSR. And I will see you again in another Brick LSR video. Thanks guys.